Hi guys, coming at you again with another quick review and I had to record this video because as you can see this here is super cute and I did not want you to miss this here. Um, I just started wearing this wig for about a week now. The first time I wore this wig it was Easter Sunday and of course with all the spring Easter colors it inspired me to get something with a little bit more color and as you can see it has a beautiful spring eastery pink going throughout the hair it has great pink highlights and as you can see the back is pink also so let me do a quick little turnaround for you So you can see the cut is short, cute, like a little messy beach curl type of deal. Um, and I'll get into further detail about the lace. The quality of this hair is soft and nice. I haven't um, added anything to the hair. I've just been throwing it on um, during the week. It's still soft and nice. I do not have any sheddings with this here at all. And I'm just so happy I can pull I can pull this look off. I saw it on the mannequin. I went to one of my local beauty supply stores. I saw it on the mannequin. I was like, I don't know, let me try that wig out real quick. Let's see if it actually worked. And um I believe it does soothe me. I'm a medium brown um skin tone. And this light pink, I think, is perfect. If you're going to do color uh, and you're not, you know, sure if it will look good on you, try different tones of color. Because I feel like if, if this was a brighter pink, it might not have looked so nice um, on me still. And because of this pink, which is a cool tone, light to me, towards medium pink, it's not too bright or anything. And it's mixed in with a, a lighter shade. This wig, by the way, is, the name of this wig is called Dolly, and this style is SR2 Pink Mocha. And this style comes in four colors. And they come in a grape color, so if you want color but in a darker tone, they have this dark, um, like 1B or 2 probably, with some purple highlights going throughout the hair. And they have this beautiful warm tone brown mixed with some deeper brown shades here. And they also have this blonder option if you want to go light without any color. And this is the one I have on um, right now. So I absolutely love this wig. The quality of this synthetic wig is one of the highest qualities. I can tell this is going to last long. And due to the fact that it's short here, it's not going to really tangle as much. So I just want to keep on wearing this here. I've gotten a lot of compliments and because of the color it inspired me to wear brighter colors in spring so I wear more pinks and purples, teals, you know, and even some sky blues and it just works with the whole look. So I've been telling people I call this wig my Easter wig because it's just, um, it fits the color scheme of this time and period. So I did, of course, because I love the style as well, I did get this in the other color, which I believe is called F42730, and I'll show you what that looks right. like, you know, however. Uh, and as I said, I haven't had anything. I've been wearing it throughout the week. It's been keeping its curls, I must say. You can just, you know, tweak it a little bit. I've been brushing it out. And it's just, it's been keeping its curls, so I like, like that fact as well. And the straps, it's actually, um, they have adjustable straps in the, um, behind. And you know how usually uh, in wigs they have the straps where you can just hook it in the middle. This one goes all the way to the side and it does not budge. Because, you know, sometimes if you, your wig is a little bit bigger, your head is smaller, and you try to adjust it and it's, it comes out loose and it's then it's loose throughout the day this does not budge it's to the side it's comfortable you don't have anything irritating 
you in the back of the um, the hairline and I can show you more of that on the other wig that I haven't tried on yet and here it is this is the as I said the F42730 and this is what that looks like you'll see this beautiful mix of colors like a honey brown uh, with a little bit of blonder golden highlights in there and has this medium brown and the like a chestnut brown mix going underneath and it's super soft as you can see this is how the curls look and I, this is how, what it looks like brushed out just combing coming it through with my fingers or using a uh, wig brush or whatever brush you have to brush it out as you can see it still kind of keeps its curls but if you want to keep it intact I know you can re-wet synthetic hair to, um, here is to get back the curls if you brush it out too much and to show you on this here what the lace looks like underneath so that's why you can part in the middle to the side well, however it gives you more flexibility where that's concerned and they have it has two combs to the sides and one in the back sorry in one of the back area and it's super comfy I mean it's just really soft and nice and I haven't tried this one on but as you can see it's really 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 cute it kind of reminds me of this but instead of pink highlights more of a golden highlights and it's not as dark in the center being cut I try to somewhat center it and push it back just like how I have the other one so this one as I said is a little bit lighter in the middle section so it looks a little bit different already but it's the same style and everything and I like to comb throughout the curls a bit and yeah as you can see the part the lace in it and everything is awesome already you know it's already kind of tinted as you can see and this is what this hair looks like super super duper cute I absolutely love it so that's what this color looks like I'm sure the other colors are just as amazing the other two colors um, this is awesome again this is by soft Swiss lace and I believe it's, it says red carpet premium I'm just gonna put in all the information so hopefully you can find this here and um, once again I just want to do a quick review to show you this style and um, once again thank you for watching